For more than a century, the North Carolina Mutual Life Insurance Company in Durham, North Carolina, has stood as a glowing symbol of black self-determination and business achievement in America. North Carolina Mutual's leadership was very influential in helping black residents of Durham at the turn of the century build one of the most successful and self-sufficient black communities in America. This community was known as Haiti. Haiti then had about, I will only say black one time, one oriental restaurant, three white businesses, 125 black businesses, a barber college, a beauty college, a shoe repair school, a radio and TV repair school, two business colleges, two movie theaters, two hotels. Then, as the civil rights era gained steam across America, the stability of Haiti and Black Durham, and the fates of many other successful black communities began to take a different turn. A community once glowing with opportunity became a community in crisis. How could an area that rose to such prominence at the turn of the century become nearly non-existent today? What was the pivotal moment? Who made the fatal decision? The lessons of Haiti.